Welcome, race fans, to beautiful Sanford, North Carolina, the home of Lee County Mud Motorsports Complex. On today's show, you're in for a treat. It's the Pro Bell Racing All-Star Nationals. Featuring professional racing organizations, blown alcohol, dirt dragsters, the drivers are ready, the cars are tuned. It's coming up next here on Mud Truck TV. Mud Truck TV, the groundbreaking show that takes you inside the world of monster mud truck action and off-road truck competition. Today's show brought to you by Pro Bell Racing. Hang on, you're about to witness the best of the best in the sport, the Pro Bell Racing All-Star Nationals on Mud Truck Television. Mud Truck Television. Tune in, log on, and experience the excitement of the world's only real television show strictly dedicated to mud race competition and off-road motorsports. Now that's racing. A great day on tap for race action here at Lee County Mud Motorsports Complex in Sanford, North Carolina. Getting us underway, it's Larry D'Antoni. Driving the Power Pro One car, hailing from the great state of Louisiana, getting locked and loaded, staged up and ready to roll. Get ready, get set, it's time to race here on Mud Truck Television. Oh, it gets a bit out of shape, almost goes over. What a save right there by Larry D'Antoni in the Power Pro One car, cranking out a 2.211 on the run. Your Pro Bell Racing instant replay. Check this out. An incredible job of driving, holding onto that car. Talk about on two wheels right there with Larry D and Tony. That's going to bring up Billy Fling driving Reality Check. Taking on this 160 foot of North Carolina dirt. Nice pass right there by the Reality Check car. A 2.192 on the run. Looks like the car doing a fantastic job of putting the horsepower to the ground, hooking up here today. And of course, anyone would tell you that knows about the sport, this is one of the best hooking tracks in the nation here at Lee County. As you can see right there with that dirt flying behind the wheels of Reality Check. That'll bring up Josh Donnell, driving the car known as Second Helping. Great looking blown alcohol dirt dragster, the Second Helping car. A vantage point from our end of track camera. Of course, the time to beat a 2.192. That's what Second Helping will be shooting for here on Mud Truck Television. The car getting locked and loaded, staged up, ready to roll. Here we go. It's time to race. Had to backpedal just a bit of 2.278 on the run. Nice job for second helping. Your Pro Bell Racing instant replay on the pass. Great run by Josh Donnell. Here on Mud Truck TV. That'll bring up Dan Richter. Driving the blown alcohol dirt dragster called Richter Scale. Staging up. If you'd like to find out more about these drivers and the cars, log on to the website, probad.com. All the driver stats and more on probad.com. The Richter scale hooking up, getting it done, a 2.159 on the pass. Not bad at all. Let's go to the instant replay now. Again, you see the tires hooking up in this 160 foot of North Carolina dirt. The end of track camera will show you what I'm talking about right there. Up next, it's Jeff Goldeisen in the ground pounder. 
huge amounts of horsepower cranking out of this car. The time to beat, again, a 2.159. Let's see if we can get it done. And boy, does he, a 1.913 on the run. Good for first place for Jeff Goldeisen and the Ground Pounder. An amazing run right there, nice and straight. That's how you do it, ladies and gentlemen. That'll bring up Scott Snarsky driving the Paperboy Express. Hailing from Libertyville, Illinois. Getting staged up, locked and loaded, looking for the green light to let the horsepower fly here on Mud Truck Television. And a 2.058 on the pass for the Paperboy Express and Scott Snarsky. Again, the instant replay on the run. You see the rooster tail. You see the tires hooking up. That's what it's all about. Scott Snarsky and the Paperboy Express. That'll bring up the owner of Lee County Mud Motorsports Complex himself, Daryl Jones and Scooby-Doo. Up in the air he goes, the Scooby-Doo truck. Looks like something happened with the clocks. No time on the run. You see the clock still running there. As we move to the Pro Bell Racing Instant Replay. Who knows, old Scooby might have jumped completely over the timing lights. Anyone that's familiar with this truck knows he is uh, known to get some air. Daryl Jones and Scooby-Doo here on Mud Truck Television. That moves us now to Bruce Wilson driving California Thunder. Bruce from Mount Pleasant, North Carolina. And again, a lot of time and effort put into these machines to get them to do what they're designed to do, which is make big horsepower and hook up and go very fast. Bruce Wilson about to show you what I'm talking about. There you see it, a 2.391 on the run for Bruce Wilson. We'll take you now to the instant replay. Let you see it one more time from both camera angles here on Mud Truck Television. That'll bring up Chuck Cordy driving the Mud Missile out of Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. Chuck, one of the many veteran drivers here today in Sanford, North Carolina at Lee County Mud Motorsports Complex. He'll be chasing that 1.913. Looks like he gets a bit of the guardrail right there. 1.999 on the pass. Still a great job. Your Pro Bell Racing Instant Replay, you notice as the car drips a bit to the left. Has to get off the throttle just a bit to drop the front tires to straighten it up. What a wild run right there. Let's take it out of Gary Baker standing by at the PRI Show. Hey, race fans. I'm here with Dave at Pro Bell Racing, and we've got some new product lines coming out that are just fantastic. Right now sitting in front of us, converter drive. Dave, this looks awesome. Thanks, Gary. This is a, all the converter drives. This one right here is for the Lenco, uh -huh. uh, Lenco drive. We also do them for the B&J Quick Drive and uh, Bruno Drive. So any of the quick drives we can do, uh, Bell Housings in 6.3 configuration, uh, has a cooling window on it now so you can attach a cooler to it to cool down the torque converter so that way your, coolant, your, your uh, fluid doesn't overheat and you get more consistent runs, more consistent launches from the trans brake uh, on the Lenco drive. Folks, I wish you could see this a lot closer like I am. This thing is a piece it's it's a work of art it, it's awesome and now you can shift you can get out there and have that converter and keep it together 
Dave, this is uh, this is just an awesome piece. What else new we got coming well, up here got, by Pro Bell? Well, we've got the uh, six two that we've got certified last year, and now I've got a funny car pedal for the nostalgia funny cars, and also the uh, NHRA style funny cars that Cruz Pedregon and Tony Pedregon have been running for the last year. Well, great. Nothing better to have some R and D with some of the best in the sport. Dave, thanks so much, buddy. Thanks. Back Gary. to you, Brian. Thanks so much, Gary Baker. And, of course, ProBell Racing. Anything else is just a can. Sean Barber now from Ellsbury, Missouri. Driving the back in black ride. Chasing that 1.913 laid down earlier by Jeff Goldeisen and the Ground Pounder. And I have to always say this when Sean Barber lines up. You gotta love the looks of that car right there. Back in black, Sean Barber, here we go. Very fast run of 2.055, and not enough for first place, but still a great run for Sean Barber. And back in black, your Pro Bell Racing Instant Replay here on Mud Truck Television. And if you'd like to find out more about what we do, log on to our website, mudtrucktv.com. Check out all of the race action. That's going to bring up Casey Gibbler, driving Bad Decision 2. Here at Lee County Mud Motorsports Complex, Sanford, North Carolina, you're watching the Pro Bell Racing All-Star Nationals with professional racing organizations, Blown Alcohol, Dirt Dragsters, it's time to race. Very nice run. A 2.222 on the run. Nice and straight. Loading the horsepower up and sticking it in the dirt. This 160 foot of North Carolina dirt. Again, your end of the track camera angle here on Mud Truck Television. Up close and personal with these machines. That moves us now to Dodd McDowell. Another great looking machine right here known as Chain Lightning. As he makes his way to the starting line getting staged up. And again he'll be chasing that 1.913 the elusive time laid down by Jeff Goldeisen. Not far off of the national record set last year by Mark the Shark Lee, that 1.909. Here we go. A 2.122 on the run for Chain Lightning. The instant replay on the run here on Mud Truck Television on the Untamed Sports TV Network. Let's go down to Gary Baker standing by in the pitch with the crew chief of Chain Lightning. Hey Brian, I'm here with uh, the Chain Lightning crew. I've got the crew chief here, Ray. Ray, I notice you guys have got some of the latest and greatest stuff for Pro Bell here on this car. Uh, looks like about brand new. Yeah, yeah. This winter we just went ahead and put a brand new uh, Pro Bell bell housing on there. Um, we looked at some other bell housings and for the the quality of the product and, and the price and everything uh, and they helped sponsor our series I mean there was no choice but to go to a Pro Bell. You can't beat a Pro Bell people. Uh, th th these aluminum cans are awesome. The price over titanium is just awesome and uh, the latest technology. My buddy Dave out there if he thinks there's something new out there that needs to be done the company jumps on it and they get it done so Ray you guys look good out there today. Yeah we're, we're trying. We're we're working on it, and uh, we used to have an old steel bell housing on there, and that thing, it was, it was like picking up a rock, and we, we saved a lot of weight for this bell housing here, and it, it's, it's really helped make the car go. Weight's everything, people. You need one, give Pro Bell a call. Dave out there will take care of you. Brian, back to you. Thanks so much, Gary Baker. Your Pro Bell Racing All-Star Nationals Round 1 results 
Jeff Goldeisen in the lead at 1.913, followed by Chuck Cordy, Sean Barber, Scott Snarsky, and routing out your top five for round one action, it's Dodd McDowell in the chain lightning car you just saw with that 2.122. We'll be right back. Welcome back to the Pro Bell All-Star Nationals here on Mud Truck Television. The action going down at Lee County Mud Motorsports Complex in Sanford, North Carolina. Round two action now with Billy Flaying back up to the starting line in reality check. Looking for that 1.913 or better. It's time to race. A 2.631 on the pass for Billy Fling and the Reality Check car. We move now to the Pro Bell Racing Instant Replay, giving you a slow motion look at each and every pass, two camera angles to check out. A great rooster tail from behind the Reality Check car, which means the tires hooking up doing what they're supposed to do. It's going to bring up Josh Donnell again, second helping the name of this blown alcohol dirt dragster taking on this 160 foot of North Carolina soil. Blazing fast run on the pass of 1.915, good enough for second place. A great job of driving right there for the second helping car. Nearly catches Jeff Goldeisen's time of 1.913. It just doesn't get much closer than that right there. Now coming to the line, it's Chuck Cordy and the Mud Missile from Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, up one more time here on Mud Truck Television. Round two action, the Pro Bell Racing All-Star Nationals. And again, the car drifting to the right, gets the guardrail out the other end, wow, still taking out a 2.010 on the time clock. An amazing job of driving right there by Chuck Cordy and the Mud Missile car. Your end of the track camera, how's this for action? Talking about up close and personal, no one gives you more action than Mud Truck TV, you see it right here. Chuck Cordy and the Mud Missile. What a run. Second round action, Jeff Goldeisen, your current leader, driving the ground pounder, chasing his own time of 1.913 laid down in the first round. Let's see if he can best it. A 1.950 on the run. Still a fantastic pass for Jeff Goldeisen and the ground pounder. Always serious and fierce competition with professional racing organizations blown alcohol dirt dragsters as you can see right there. Scott Snarsky back to the line in the Paperboy Express here on Mud Truck Television. Wow, a 2.019 for the Paperboy Express and Scott Snarsky. Your Pro Bell Racing instant replay on the run. Both camera angles filled with the action of the Paperboy Express. Look at the rooster tail. Fantastic race action here on Mud Truck TV. Daryl Jones coming back to the line in Scooby-Doo. Look out, here we go. A nice wheel stand by Daryl Jones and Scooby-Doo. Laying down a time of 3.649. Up in the air he goes. In the Scooby-Doo truck. Known by many as the greatest hill and hole truck in the entire world. Right there, you see him, Scooby-Doo, on Mud Truck TV. Bruce Wilson back to the line now. Round two action here on Mud Truck TV in California Thunder. Chasing that 1.913.
doesn't quite get it. A 2.730 on the run. Still a nice pass for the California Thunder Car. Here on Mud Truck Television and the Untamed Sports TV Network. Back to the line now, Sean Barber from Ellsbury, Missouri, driving back in black here on Mud Truck TV. All of these drivers looking to take home the win today. He's locked, loaded, ready to go. A 1.942 on the run, very fast and straight for Sean Barber. The instant replay on the run, you'll see what I'm talking about. The front tires perfectly straight the entire run. Nice job for Sean Barber and back in black. Moving now to our next competitor, Casey Gibbler and Bad Decision 2 here on Mud Truck TV. A very nice looking blown alcohol dirt dragster. If you're looking for the best in parts and service supplies, PowerProRacingProducts.com. Check out the website. Everything you need to be the next champion. And of course, ProBell Racing, our sponsor for today's All Star National Event. Checking the safety equipment, making sure he's strapped in, the helmet's ready, and the car is ready, all the gauges reading go, and he will move to the line. The Pro Bell Racing All-Star Nationals on Mud Truck Television. Locked, loaded, ready to go, it's time to race. A 2.198 on the run. Not good enough for first place, but still a fantastic time. As we check out your Pro Bell Racing Instant Replay here on Mud Truck TV. If you've never had a chance to see one of these races up close and personal, you need to attend the event. You can literally feel the ground shake as these cars go by. Dodd McDowell now, second round action in the chain lightning car. And a 2.053 on the run for the chain lightning car. As we move to the instant replay, you see another nice straight run. The tires hooking up in this 160 feet, in this 160 feet of North Carolina soil here on Mud Truck TV. And the Pro Bell Racing All-Star Nationals. Final results, Jeff Goldeisen takes home the win, a 1.913 in the ground pounder, followed by Josh Donnell, Sean Barber, Chuck Cordy, and rounding out your top five at Scott Snarsky and the Paperboy Express with that 2.058. Gary Baker standing by with your winner, Jeff Goldeisen. Hey, Brian. I'm here with the winner today's Pro Bell All-Star Nationals, Jeff Goldeisen with Ground Pounder. Jeff, a 1.913, almost on the national record. That was a good run today. Yeah, we've been been a long time getting here, and of course we had a lot of help from everybody, from yourself and Mark and Rodney and all the guys that help us and everybody that we really appreciate it, and we've been waiting a long time to, to get a good run on us. So. Well, a lot of people don't understand running a business, doing other things, these races all over the place. It takes a lot of time and you can't just go out and test these cars anywhere. So it takes a while to take running them down the tracks to get these things where you want them, doesn't it, buddy? Oh yeah, I mean, you got to just constantly full with these cars to get them to get them right and uh, you know right. today was just our day we got the car right and it went down the track and we made a good pass we tried to do a do a little better the second pass and pulled a little bit and had, we had to 
come out of it, so we'll, we'll try her again. That's all right. Hey, you had enough on it today to pull the win, and uh, congratulations, buddy. Thank you, Gary. Brian, back to you. Today's race filmed on location at Lee County Mud Motorsports Complex in Sanford, North Carolina. Find out more at ncmudracing.net. Lee County Mud Motorsports Complex, home of the fastest hill and hole trucks in the world. Mud Truck TV would like to extend a special thanks to all of the staff at Lee County Mud Motorsports Complex for making this another fantastic event. And thanks to our sponsor, Pro Bell Racing. Anything else is just a can. Buy a ticket, find a race near you, and go check out the exciting race action with professional racing organizations Blown Alcohol, Dirt Dragsters. For Mud Truck TV, I'm Brian Austin. We'll see you at the races.